good afternoon everybody this is Dawn aka the interactive nanny coming to you again live and in living color from interactive nanny's world where love and play are interactive so today this afternoon we're getting ready to do um just a little story time for the little and um the first book i'm going to read is for the i guess maybe the toddler age the 12 to 18 months it's um a song slash story <laughs> i mean anybody it's, you know it once you learn it all age groups get into it it's one of my actually one of my favorite i guess songs finger plays etc etc but the, anyway the um title of this book is the it's a busy spider like i said i'm sure everybody knows the song Itsy Bitsy Spider, but it's also a book Itsy Bitsy Spider. So we're getting ready to read this one. We also have another book that we'll read after this one, but we're getting ready to read Itsy Bitsy Spider. The Itsy Bitsy Spider climbed up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. So the Itsy Bitsy Spider climbed up the spout again. And, I mean, if you're going to do it in, as, as the song slash finger play, you just sing the song. And most people know the little hand movement that go the finger play, whatever, that goes along with the song, which is the itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. And you just repeat it however many times you want to. And if you're doing the finger play, the finger play also help not just help um, helps them learn the song and, re- and retain the song. It, it also working with their fine motor skills, working working with them following instructions and directions, and working you know helping them to sort of um, use their memory skills and stuff like that so that was the itsy bitsy spider the next book i'm gonna read is it's a um kingdom's kid bible book and it's the title of it is martha and mary so um we know the story of martha and mary as far as i I mean well if you're reading the bible anyway you should know the story of martha and mary but anyway, we're going to read the story of Martha and Mary, and it's coming from Luke chapter 10, verses 38 through 42. Jesus came to visit their house. Mary and Martha were so excited. They knew Jesus was their special friend. They believed Jesus was the Son of God. Jesus was here to visit. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Martha cleaned the whole table. Swish, swoosh, swish, swoosh. Martha swept the floor. Jesus was here to visit. Mary sat at Jesus' feet, listening to every word he said. She listened and listened, learning more about God. Jesus was here to visit. Chop, chop, chop. Martha fixed food. Splish, splash, splish, splash. Martha washed dishes. Jesus was here to visit. Mary still sat at Jesus' feet, listening to his words about God. Suddenly, Martha stopped cooking and cleaning. Jesus, Martha cried, I'm doing all the work. Tell my sister Mary to come help me. Martha, Jesus said with a smile, Mary has discovered how important it is to spend time with me learning about God. Stop being busy for a while. Come sit beside Mary. I want you to spend time with me too. I like to spend time with Jesus. Today I pray. Dear Jesus, help me remember to spend time with you every day. Amen. I know it's important to spend time with Jesus and with God. The Bible tells me how Jesus spent time with God too. Here's a verse that tells me what Jesus did. Jesus went up to the mountainside to pray, and this is from Mark 6 and 46. Jesus is always near you, loving you and caring for you. Even though you can't see him, you can have a special time every day to sit, 
still and vivid with Jesus, just like Mary did. Wear your special watch at least once a day. When you put it on, it will help you remember to stop being busy for a while and take time to visit with Jesus. Today I had a special visit with Jesus. I listened to a song about Jesus. I read my Bible today. I prayed and talked to Jesus today. I sang a song about Jesus today. I watched a video about Jesus today. I read a Bible storybook today. I told Jesus I love him today. And um, that's the end of both of our stories for today. So, um, again, I hope you guys enjoyed the stories. I hope you guys enjoy coming on and listening to Inactive Nanny's World and hanging out with me. Um, I look forward to coming on with you guys and um, sharing and, you know, I hope you guys are liking, subscribing, and sharing Inactive Nanny's World. If you have any questions, you can um, contact me through the Anchor app or you can email me at Inactive Nanny's World. I mean, no, 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 no. <laughs> In my bad. I'm sorry, guys. I'm thinking about an email address for the podcast, but you can email me at inactivenanny at gmail.com. Again, this is Don, a.k.a. the Inactive Nanny, signing off from Inactive Nanny's World, where love and play are interactive, and I look forward to sharing with you guys again next week. See you later. Bye-bye.